Next up. Music. Another, yeah. Music of the year. Soundtrack or song. So, songs have an uphill battle, but it's definitely <sighs> possible here. So, to, first up, Dragon Age Inquisition. For their Daft Punk soundtrack. <laughs> <laughs> Is it really? No. <laughs> Shovel Knight. Just, just a bunch of EDM. <laughs> yeah. Transistor. Wah, 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 wah. <laughs> Super Smash Bros. Yeah. Far Cry 4. <laughs> the elephant. Mon- monetization. <laughs> <laughs> Fight that, Jason. Uh, Some cool. Valiant Hearts. The Wolf Some Among Us. Cool music and crap. Hey, World of Warcraft. You're driving down those mountain paths. Yep. Welcome to the show. Warlords of Draenor. It's probably Draenor, but I don't know how to say it. So. Sunset Overdrive. I can't decide if that soundtrack is awesome or terrible. Sus- Sus- Susnet Destiny. <laughs> Sus- if you're fired. <laughs> <laughs> and Destiny. And uh, Child of Light. And Child of Light. And Crossy Root. I, I never sticks. have the music. I, I don't know what that game sounds like. In PT. <laughs> yeah, I've never had the volume on. Um, I Coop and I'll give a shout out to the Wolfenstein yeah. soundtrack because Wolfenstein. Was yep, it was, it was surprising that I noticed it. So, um, it was good, not at the same time. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what That's that? what Crossy Road sounds like. <laughs> Crossy Road. I feel bad yes. that we don't have like the artists behind this. So if we get so down to the either. finals and someone can help me look those I'll up, say if Destiny's on there, can Master Chief be on there too? Same um, composer, same music. <laughs> Maybe, it's although right. Master so Chief is not new music. It's all the it's all same. Transistor has um, the like the the theme song that the um, the girl is singing in. I mean that mm-hmm. one's great. Yeah, but I don't I don't think I care for any of the other music on the CD. That's the only reason why I. Soundtrack. I, I mean, I like the whole soundtrack. I so. love that song, but I don't I don't think I care. It's really for any of the other jazzy. Song. I, I yeah I love that. Transistor and Shovel Knight are the two that I just listen to all. I don't time. think I could listen to Shovel Knight. I kind of struggle with this category because for me, there's me there's soundtracks that I like to listen to outside of the game, but then there's soundtracks that make the game. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. It's like Valiant Hearts you would never listen to by itself. Sure. Oh, but, it's, yeah. but it totally makes that game sad. Well, yeah, you have to have the narrator. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. The, the pop punk Sunset Overdrive soundtrack fits the game really, really well. Oh, well, yeah. And there are yeah. a couple great moments where it fits. Yeah. It fit, but overall, it's forgettable. Yeah, overall, it's like a subpar Blink-182, so whatever that means. Uh, it sounds like, are we cutting Destiny? <laughs> yeah, Destiny's in the same category. <laughs> Sorry, know, Mike's, Dean. Mike's making the case, guys. Sorry, Destiny. I Destiny, I actually would vote, I would actually vote for Destiny. Okay. I that, can't that's, listen to that's that fucking the start music, screen music. Man. Yeah, it's it's got a pretty good epicness to it. Does Dean Glitch sing? <laughs> Um, I'm not going to win over anybody, but I will say... say yeah, well, I think WoW gets <laughs> cut before Destiny. <laughs> you don't even know what it is. It's fucking it's great. It's not good. <laughs> it's wow, regardless. so it can't be good. <sighs> you're playing. You're Now he doesn't want to cut it I'm, just because you said that. I got that. a free trial of WoW. I paid $5 for expansion, and I don't <laughs> listen to music when I play that game. Ah, it's so good. I listen to my own music. Zug Zug. I'm just saying, it's, it's just more orchestral Warcraft music but I the fact that I noticed it and it it's uh, it's it's that they're still <laughs> focusing on making quality music for their money generating machine that the, this <laughs> game is uh, um, the machine it's it's worth mentioning so okay and Child of Light's all orchestral piano flute music so okay if you're we'll not into it. that <laughs> that's boring <laughs> I Tell me more about the flute. So, like a Renaissance festival. What's uh? Yeah, I don't even remember the music in the Wolf Among Us. I remember it's the got, episode starts credits. It's got or some funky eightiesness to it. Yeah, like it's New cool. York eighties. Yeah, yeah. But it's no Hotline Miami, so it. <laughs> yeah, right. Far Cry Four. <laughs> Talk to me. I didn't put elephants. It <laughs> I voted. I was like, this I voted for it most, <laughs> mostly just due to the fact that when I, <laughs> I'll be driving and I hate it because. It messes up with my monetization, but it, I don't know. It just, it really just paints that, that picture of that atmosphere, but I would definitely put Destiny above Far Cry 4, but there are just some definite cutscenes and moments that are just really surreal with the music. 
Yeah, there are times when the music yeah. is a f- more effective than others, mm-hmm. but I don't consider it. I wouldn't. Yeah, music I, of the year. No, no, no. That's I. I, I just. Do you think it can make the finals? I mean, you're, you, I don't think it, you said one game, but it's not better than so. I don't think it makes the finals. Okay. No, not compared to everything else. Okay. What about Smash Brothers? Dude, I really fucking, fucking love bre- the breadth of that yeah. bullshit. I fucking love Nintendo music, is and there are some original remixes in there, so it's not all just old. I think that's stuff. the thing for me, though, is it's Nintendo music, but there's, there's so much special of it. about. There's a lot, but <laughs> Mega Man remixes. Ooh, but you remixes. could. It doesn't really do anything for the game because you could swap in any other Nintendo yeah. music and it's the same game. Whereas, like it with hits all the nostalgic notes, but that's it. It doesn't. It so just it just makes it, it just makes it. you remember Nintendo rather than enhancing the I game. I choose the Mega Man stage because I want to see the hear the Mega Man music while I. Yeah, I don't do know if Mega I'd go Man that stuff. far to say it, you could just swap in anything is, else and it doesn't. The whole game is anything. nostalgia. So yeah, the entire game is. It plays right into that. It's, yeah, it's playing into your love of Nintendo things and Mega Man. There's no one song, but it's just like they're not yeah, the or something. And they're, and they're giving out the soundtrack for real. Like if you got 3DS and the Wii U version, <laughs> so it they're considering it a soundtrack. Uh, I, I feel like, I feel like that's the same thing as saying Super Smash Brothers gets Character of the Year because it has Mega Man in it or something. I like would that. never <laughs> have done <laughs> but, that. But you know, <laughs> wow, Cole's I super blurry. Yeah. I know. I was like, <laughs> I was like, I've been drinking, but I'm <laughs> Cole. <laughs> Cause he leaned leaned too um, far back. Cole, are you with me on how? awesome the intro theme to dragon age inquisition is yeah i love dragon age music uh it's it's and i and throughout the game it's not just the the intro songs like throughout the game the subtle ways that it comes back to life after when you get into a battle and then kind of slowly fades away when you're not in danger i just really like the implementation and uh, the score of that game overall i was impressed by it um more so the destiny i would i would actually have to say I would too, yeah. Um, throwing that out there. Shovel Knight is, you know, it fits solid. right in with what it, what it, the retroness of the game, and they pulled in the, the Mega Man composer to help out, um, which was really cool. Um, <laughs> I would, so I would, cho- <laughs> for retro music, I would actually, I would choose Shovel Knight over Smash Bros. I got kind of, I got kind of sick of Shovel Knight's retro music after a while. I mean, if you don't mm. like chip tunes, yeah, I do though. That's, that's, <laughs> that's I mean, that, careful I, now. I do listen to chip tunes while I work. And, right, I, so. I might have heard better chip tunes before than Shovel okay. Knight's. But I really, yeah. I like Shovel Knight's music. I think it's fitting. Oh yeah, it's fitting for the game. But where am I? I do at? not think I could just listen to that music for me not neither. Want, and not want to pick. Where up are we at with Transistor? Nobody's talked about Transistor. I talking? fucking love Transistor. I just like the one song. Music. That's good in it. Yeah. The rest like of I didn't, I didn't, I, really I don't like the game, but I liked the music while I was playing the game. Is it on the same level as like the Bastion music? It's a right, a notch half, a half a notch below it. Below yeah. it, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Bastion was but still fantastic, pretty, but pretty good. Transition. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Right now, I am with Dragon Age, Transistor, and Valiant Hearts. Yeah, I'm, I'm Valiant Hearts and Transistor. The third is. Is anybody fighting for Destiny right now? I am. Okay. I'd be Dragon Age, Destiny, and Child of Light. I'm fine with cutting Shovel Knight. Okay. It sounds like... Yeah. yeah, it's, yeah it sounds like can, that's yeah. happening. It's good chip tune, but it's not standout chip tune. Okay. Yeah. That, yeah. Does anybody else have Smash's back? No. I don't feel that way. Mm-hmm. And, I mean, that's fine. If it, if it gets cut, it gets cut. Because, I mean, we're talking about... If I it do gets like cut, trans- you get cut. If you get cut, <laughs> it will <gets> cut on <laughs> you. Because I like transistor music. I do like that. I just don't know Valiant Hearts. I wish I could listen to this Destiny song link Dean shared. Child of Light didn't really... I don't think it had an impact on me. I don't remember anything. Yeah, I mean, I had to actively yesterday while I was like, pay attention to it for this specific topic. So, I mean, there's like I said, there's nothing... It's just orchestral piano. And flute uh, music. Valiant Hearts is very much complementary to the atmosphere. Um, and it just fits that game. The game would be kind of boring without the music. Potentially, I mean, it helps tell the story. It's a very important part of it. <laughs> yeah. For Inquisition, I care more about what the people are saying than the music that's playing. I, yeah, a game I like that. I I would, like, a game like, like that, I would turn the music down. I mean, I hate to tie it back to Warcraft since y'all hate it, but like part of me playing fantasy games or fantasy RPGs is some of that atmosphere, and I like that that great or orchestral score uh, to complement what's going on and kind of rising and falling with the action and. 
Yeah. Like I said, and then it, it has, it's a solid soundtrack in game, and then the theme is really strong too. I mean, on that side of it, that's the redeeming side to Destiny 2 because the game kind of sucks, but the music is yep holds it together. The music's almost as good as the skyboxes. I prefer Destiny's music to Dragon Age then. I'm fine with both of them making it with Transistor. But I, so I could. I, think I, I am uh, too. I'm okay with eliminating Shadow of Light. But get rid of Smash Brothers. I first. don't know if I can vote Destiny over Valiant Hearts just yeah, because if, I've heard okay, Destiny yeah, if, music before. If Jason wants to give up Shadow of Light, because we that so so we yeah, cut true. we cut Shovel Knight because it's not standout chip music, and to me, Destiny music isn't any different than Halo music, so it doesn't really stand out to me in a special way either. Uh, no. I think it just helps paint the, the I mean, picture it, of the it, universe. It, yeah, it fits the world, which is Halo. And if I don't know it, that, that. <laughs> which is Halo. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I mean, no. I mean that 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 start screen music, the yeah. when it's loading, that is it is Destiny. Like it's me. It has as much impact as yeah. I mean, and Dragon Age is very very similar in that regard. See, Transistor is the only one on. Here okay, so it. actually, Valiant Hearts is the only one that I don't have that signature sound for. Like, yeah. you could actually play me other music that is like Valiant Hearts, and I might not be able to tell you that it's from the Val- from Valiant Hearts. Um, granted, you could do the same thing with this is a is this a Halo track or a Destiny <laughs> track? But the theme kind of helps. Um, so, Transistor saying sounds like yeah yes okay. Um, What's everybody's thoughts on Valiant Hearts? I just don't know what it's Nobody's heard it, but I can tell you. I just don't know what it sounds like. Who hates Destiny? I don't. I don't. I don't. And we, four. And who? It, were, you're the detractor on Dragon Age, Aaron, maybe? Currently, I guess I am. Okay. I, oh, and Jordan was. Yeah, I would too. Okay. I would, I would yeah. Go Orange Honey Badgers. Shit. <laughs> 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 Where's Cole in? Cole, yeah, where's Cole? I'm at uh, Dragon Age and Destiny and Transistor, probably. I, I haven't heard anything from Valiant Hearts. I, so. I'm okay with that. Yeah. And if you guys are saying the Transistor is a step, half a step below Bastion, and I love the Bastion soundtrack, I think it has to be on the list then. Yeah, I don't have any problems with that. Okay. Sorry, Valiant Hearts. It's weak, guys. Valiant it's weak. It just sounds like a lot of us need to play it. Yes, you do. Yeah, I, I really want to play. It. Like, I feel like convince me for sure. And to help, and you know, to instantly hate the like narrator. Dragon I will probably Age love the narrator. In the That's same the problem. Category. <laughs> it's like I epic. Just, I got that Eminem thing in my head. And I could <laughs> see <laughs> orchest- <laughs> epic orchestral music right. and Valiant Hearts is different. That's the, the fuck wins. Nobody. I'm, I'm going with Dragon Age. It's like Alien versus Predator scenario. I think uh, Transistor. <laughs> I want to pick Transistor. Transistor. I vote Destiny. Sound. <laughs> sounds like transi- well, let, me, age, let, me, so let me double check. Sounds like Transistor is going to win. Yeah. Uh, <coughs> well, we had two Transistor. Transistor two and eight. Destiny are tied. Oh, uh, where's Jordan at? Transistor. Yeah, I think Transistor wins. In. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Music of the year. Um, what is that? Darren Korb, I believe, is his name. Um, yeah. For the soundtrack for Transistor. Um, yeah. And runners up Dragon Age Inquisition. By the EA soundtracks. Uh, <laughs> uh, now, what's her name? Who was on the 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 award show you went to? Um, the the violinist lady. She uh, contributed. Yeah, I don't remember what her Damn name it. is. <laughs> Lindsay Sterling. Yes, Lindsay Sterling, <laughs> Lindsay Sterling was, Sterling, all, was somewhat a part of that was, project. She was awesome in person. And then uh, the dude that was fired for the Destiny soundtrack. Marty Browning or Marty O'Donnell. McDonald. All right, we got it. We got it all figured Yay. out. Volume down, talking up. All right.